Good morning ladies. Just wanted to share my junk journal with you. Um, I've recently joined a group on Facebook called Junk Journal Junkies. Um, and Yvonne, who um, is the group administrator, owner, whatever you want to call it, challenged me to make, because she knows I've got a bit of an aversion to, ju uh, to journals in general really, because I have tried a couple before. Um, I can't sew. I can't say that I don't like sewing because I just can't do it. <laughs> it doesn't work for me. So it all ends up baggy and everything. So I just put journal into one journals to one side so and make more mini albums. But she challenged me to make a junk journal and this is what I've made. Um, I've used this set. I was in a swap on UK and Ireland craft swaps and we had to make some Project Life journals and they matched this set because when she, uh, it was from Deborah Hemsworth, when she sent me the Project Life cards, she enclosed papers, um, stickers, uh, chipboard pieces, brads, all that sort of thing. I've got a few bits and pieces left over and it's um, simple stories vintage bliss so that was the sticker sheet so I used everything that she sent me to make this journal um, I bound it with my bind it all because I've only used that I think this is the second or third time um, I did muck it up a bit around this bit here but you can't see it so and it's for me just attach this um, string just to keep it closed and I just flip through the pages oh and I used um, squeeze lemonade distress ink Tim Holtz distress ink as well so on the pages it's a nice summary one so these are all the cards as well that came with the set so they're in there that's one of my stamps it says the role of the writer is not to say what we all can say, but what we are unable to say. I like that. So, um, and the Brad in the corner says hi. So, just quickly run through again. These all came with the set. So, I've added these in. I'm not sure if they're supposed to be rub ons or what, but I just added them into the page. Another of my stamps. Sorry. Uh, one of the chip chipboard pieces on there, little umbrella. Very cute. Postcard. Some more of these. And some frames that came with it as well I added those on and some little chipboard butterflies and hearts that came out of this top bit here um, an envelope that I've added and just put a little flower stamp on there and a butterfly at the back sorry I'm a bit not a good angle let me just try and that's a bit better isn't it um, another Journal card, another frame with a little flower in it, I like this paper. I've left these brads open because as I use it, I'll, I'll cover those bits and pieces up. I love these papers, they're so lovely and summery. That says good times, not sure if you can see that at this angle. Another one of those acetate frames. I just left that like that because I thought I could just put a photo in there and then seal the bottom so it doesn't fall out. Another chipboard, little welly boot. It says bliss. Some bingo papers, another little chipboard piece on the envelope, and a sticker of butterflies. Two of those. 
I haven't put anything in there as yet. Just another sheet of white. And these are the journaling cards that Deborah Hemsworth made for me. That one says laugh. Really lovely. Lovely set this is. Another postcard. Another acetate. That says just peachy down the bottom. Just a plain sheet for journaling. Another two cards. A little frame on it. And space for journaling in there. This is, I don't know if you can see that, little dragonfly from stamp set. Can't remember which one, I'll have to have a look. Keep calm and smile on. <laughs> I expect a lot of you have seen this. Live every moment, laugh every day, love beyond words. I think that came with a magazine, so a lot of you have probably got that. Another envelope that I had laying around, and I put another Project Life journaling card in there. See, they don't have to be for Project Life, do they? That's uh, Brad. So smile big. Don't worry, be happy. <laughs> and that Brad there, that says be happy as well. Another acetate. Another Project Life card, click, like that one. Some chipboard pieces on the back, I added in a doily. I've left it open because I don't know what I'm going to do, whether I'm going to tuck something under there or what, so I didn't stick it down or anything. Um, some more stickers and some more little flower chipboard pieces. Some graph paper. Another little envelope. This came from the Pickles and Onion stamp set. And there's another card in there. And this is a, another stamp set that I've had forever and hardly use. I thought I'd put that in there. I do um, family history, so I just thought that was... A good idea if I needed to write anything in there about my family history. Another card. Spread sunshine. Be kind. Another envelope with another card. That one says snap. Clever, aren't they? I think she said she did these on her cameo. I think. Not sure. That's the front of the envelope, and this is H's for happy. Good times there. Another chipboard piece. A little bottle with some flowers, a little jar, sorry, with some flowers in it. It says sweet. Another envelope with um, a little bit of stamping and another sticker butterfly. Nothing in there. That one I just... Oh, up to the page. I haven't put anything in there but it's open if, uh, if I want to. And that butterfly paper, I just love it. It's beautiful. Another card. Smile. Spread your wings and fly. Hello sunshine at the top there. And another frame acetate and another Project Life card it says happy and I just stuck a little bread up there as well that says think happy and that matches that paper and that's the back page and there that lovely butterfly paper again so Yvonne challenge complete I think don't you? I'm really pleased with that, hope everyone likes it, oh while I'm here, also on junk journal junkies, there is a seven day journal challenge. You have to make a journal and then from the 20th, which is tomorrow, for seven days, you have to complete a page. So what this is my base 
of my junk journal. I haven't put any colouring papers or anything. It's just card and the covers. This binding, Yvonne put me onto this as well because she knows I can't sew. Um, it's from a tutorial by Sarah Elliott on YouTube. And, and it literally just uses twine wrapped around here and on the inside. I'll show you inside in a minute and then I've just added this ribbon to keep it closed I haven't cut it I've wrapped it around a couple of times because I want it to expand so when it's all full up then I'll cut, cut it to size so I'll just sit and fiddle with this for half an hour now and try and undo it See what I mean by sewing and things? That's just too finicky for my big fat fingers. Okay, so that's that. And as I said, you just wrap the twine around this piece that I can't even remember it's too early in the morning I can't even remember what this piece here is called that's the front and the back and that is the uh, spine that's the word isn't it <laughs> sorry I'm just not with it yet today um, so that's the front and the back and the twine once you've wrapped it round you just get some card and place each card you Wrap it round as many times as you as you want, or as will fit. I can't remember what I am. Um, just need to grab that bit. There. Okay, so this is my first bit of twine, and all you do is slip the card under there. And that's my journal all made look ready to be um, used as from tomorrow so I will do another video next week I just put some holes here again Sarah Elliott showed you how to do just put some holes and put your um, lace through just to help keep it closed so that's it I've even got some spare twines hanging around so that when I actually do use it I can slip in some more envelopes and things like that on these spare bits of twine so I'm really pleased with it it's a bit wonky at the moment but I'm hoping once I've filled it that will sort that little problem out so that's it if you're interested in junk journals and want to come over and have some fun it's junk journal junkies on facebook and i will see you next week with my completed journal thanks for watching bye